Each year, billions and billions of dollars are being spent on road maintenance by different countries all over the world. Likewise, Malaysia in 2022 has an estimate budget of 1 billion ringgits for road maintenance and repairs. But the techniques that are used for maintenance are mostly manual, which are not only laborious, costly, time-consuming, subjective, but very risky to the inspectors as well. Therefore, there is an urgent need for an autonomous system which is very efficient in dealing with these issues and help in payment maintenance. Assalamu alaikum and hi everyone. My name is Arslan Ashraf and my research topic is on payment crack detection, classification and characterization using deep learning and pixel level segmentation. Artificial intelligence or AI has boosted the automation process in various spheres like banking, finance, automotive, healthcare, security, surveillance, infrastructure, and many, many more. Especially the inclusion of effective computation techniques based on machine learning and deep learning has become a macro trend in the automation sector. Automation using automotive computing is already proven compelling and therefore we aim to employ the same in the sphere of road maintenance. For the development of any machine learning model, the data plays a very important role. Therefore, our objective is to collect the road crack myths from the roads across Kuala Lumpur and IAUM. Secondly, we'll be using deep learning and pixel level segmentation for the development of the payment crack detection, classification and characterization model. We will be evaluating our model and checking the performance parameters and finally benchmarking our results. For the development of this project, what are the materials and the methods we require? We require a computer system with some graphical computational power in it. If you will see my right screen, you will find these boxes. These boxes are called the bounding boxes, which are used for labeling objects inside an image. In our case, we have road cracks. Then these labeled images are used for training the machine learning model. The machine learning model is trained using an IDE, which you will see on my left screen. The IDE used for this research is the Google Colab. There are different other types of IDEs as well, in which we write our machine learning code, then we evaluate our results in the form of precision, recall, F1 score and confusion matrix. Here you will see some of the graphs which represent the learning rate, the F1 score, the recall of the training parameter. Also we have the confusion matrix. With these, we can tell how accurately our model has been trained and we can also test our results. Likewise, when our model is being tra trained and tested, we can then finally use the model on the image or the videos in order to determine and detect and classify the cracks and finally categorize the cracks based on the size. Each year, a large amount of money is spent on road networks for construction, renewal and repairs. The road sector has started to consider a new approach to road maintenance by adopting a preservation culture, which consists in immediately protecting structures once they are constructed or renewed. However, the problem persists as there is a lack of the required precise information about the road conditions. In manual road inspections, inspectors go all over the road measuring its distress elements. But these surveys become too laborious and slow to allow an extensive assessment. These inspections are costly and risky for the personnel due to traffic hazards. They also have problems associated with variability and repeatability resulting on inconsistencies in distress details. Therefore, manual road surveys do not allow one to carry out proper road maintenance. An automated distress detection system to quantify the quality of the road surface and assist in prioritizing and planning the maintenance of the road network becomes highly essential. Our research contributes in dealing with the issues that are faced due to manual inspection techniques. We intend to use artificial intelligence for the detection, classification and the characterization of the road cracks. This will help in reducing the cost, time as well as the risk to the inspectors. We can ensure the safety and the comfort of the drivers as well as the vehicles. Therefore. Inclined with the fourth industrial revolution, artificial intelligence is set as the driving force for this revolution. 
Likewise, Malaysia in its national policy on science, technology and innovation aims to develop Malaysia as the high-tech nation by the end of 2030. Since our research project is in line with the national policy of Malaysia on science, technology and innovation and also with that of fourth industrial revolution on automation and providing some high-tech solutions, we aim to contribute in the sector of road maintenance. Thank you very much. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.